who were fake outraged, quote unquote. And I don't even think people are really outraged. I see more people talking about people being outraged, and I'm seeing more people make videos saying that they are outraged that Annette was race swapped for instead of being the violet haired, turquoise haired, whatever she is, white woman from the video game. She's Annette, a Haitian woman from the island of Domingo, born into slavery. I can tell you for me personally, you know, in the last Castlevania, they did that too. They race swapped Isaac, like the guy who's the, um, I forgot what they're called. That name escapes, but the people who work with death magic or magic of uh, death magic, they race swapped him for the black ball dude, Isaac, in the TV show. But the difference was between Isaac and Annette, and we all can agree with this Isaac was raw in the fucking paint, bro. Black Isaac was raw as fuck. We all can, ain't nobody can, Isaac was raw. Isaac, we can all say raw. Isaac from that Castlevania Netflix series, he was fucking raw, bro. Annette in this series, and like I told you before, I, I watched it in Spanish. I didn't like her voice acting in English. I love her backstory. I love the root of her power. Like I told y'all, I grew up reading about Ogum, Yamanja, Oshu. For those who do not know, these are the gods of the um, of the Yoda, but the gods where she gets her power from. So I grew up reading about that. So I love that. I love the idea. I love her powers, but I didn't like her fighting choreography. And... Her fighting choreography, fighting choreography is a really big thing for me in, in TV shows. Like, even when I watched The Mandalorian, I didn't like the first season of The Mandalorian because I didn't like the his fighting choreography, The Mandalorian's fighting choreography. Now, granted, the motherfucker had a 100-pound suit on, so I could, I, think I could cut him some slack. But um, neither here nor there. I think people would maybe be less pissed off about Annette if maybe her character, I'd say, was more... I personally, her story gravitated to me. I liked her story personally because I'm a fan of this. I'm a fan of Haitian culture as well as Santa Dia and Condoble Umbanda, the gods of those cultures. I think her personality in the show, and I can say in English for the English dub, it didn't stand out to me. The English voices actors, it kind of got on my nerves. Now, when I watched it in Spanish, when I watched it in European Spanish, it was kind of a little bit doper. Um, Edward was cool. I fuck with Edward. Edward's, in, Ed, Edward's arc was interesting to me. But yeah, so yeah, that's my thoughts on that.